perfect. Unbelievable. Sweet deal. I didn't think it was going to work. I think it was going to happen. I believed in Jake. I didn't believe in myself. <laughs> Welcome back guys, we are at Shaded Days. We got the S4 here. We are doing some more cosmetic mods. We're getting the uh, the Stormtrooper look almost finished, or the Panda look, however you want to call it. But the car's getting hosed off right now. And I'll be doing some, maybe some tints on the headlights, taillights, a roof wrap, maybe the spoiler yet. I'm not sure, we're gonna finish up the look. Thanks for clicking on this video and we will get to it guys. Here's kind of the plan for the car right now. We're gonna do like a light smoke on the headlights. Um, I think that'll look pretty sick. It'll kind of blend in real well. And then we're gonna do a, a black roof wrap. Then we're gonna tie it up in the rear. We're gonna do a black wrap on the spoiler. We'll get the mid smoke on the tails. And then to match that, we're gonna do the mid smoke on the rear uh, side markers. So I think these little accents are gonna look awesome. It's gonna complete that stormtrooper. It's gonna complete the panda look. <laughs> so the car's all clean. Um, it was super satisfying seeing the car get clean. You guys know in the Midwest when it gets salty and snowy, the car just gets dirty so quick. So uh, I'll let it dry a little bit and then we're gonna get, work, get to work on the car. But in addition, we did have our favorite today. Big kick on our lightly caffeinated sparkling water here, boys. This one is cucumber pear, refreshing. It gets the job done. So caffeinated sparkling waters, you better get on it. Baked in coffee beans. Cheers. All right guys, so here is the headlight tint. We're gonna go with the light smoke on the headlights. Jake's currently cutting up a sample right now. We're gonna just place it on the headlight to kind of see what it looks like if you really just wanna go this route and just kind of see um, just a quick sample before we go full in with uh, wrapping the whole headlights and the light smoke. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Oh, that's not bad. That looks pretty good. Oh yeah, that's not bad. What do you think? Light smoke? Yeah. Should we turn the car on and see the headlights first? Kind of see what it, I don't know what it looks like. I don't know. Yeah. What do you think? I think it looks good. I think it looks good. Yeah, I think it looks great. Not too bad. Yeah. And it doesn't take away too just, much of the visibility, you know, I think from the light. Yeah. Just get a little bit of that reflection right there. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? They see like yeah, right there. Yeah, just put that on this side. Yeah. Hmm. Crap, I didn't even think about that. So we have a little bit of a reflection on the headlight from the tint. So we might be coming into a little issue here. Uh I wonder. Decisions, decisions. Yeah. Uh -oh. Damn, yeah. Maybe we maybe we just won't tint the headlights on. Okay, new plan boys. We're not gonna do the headlight tint, um, but we are gonna do a little custom front end with some wrap. We're gonna take a little bit of the black uh, gloss, just do a strip from here to here. It kind of connects the headlights to the grill. I saw a couple people do it online and it looked really, really good. So we're gonna do that instead. You know, make it look like a panda? <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right guys, so we did the first 
headlight. We got the little black strip in there. It kind of just blends the whole headlight into the grill. Uh, we're having a hard time figuring out if we wanted to connect it as a straight line. So from here to here or connect it all the way to the edge of the grill. Um, I think either way, it looks pretty cool. I just think we got to figure out right now if we just want to keep it as a straight line like that off or connect it into the grill on an angle. But I don't know, it's looking cool. It's just a little bit of touch that's adding just a little bit of style to the front end that, I don't know, I think it looks pretty cool. Chill. Chill. <laughs> okay. All right, so we're going to do the other side next. We're going to see how that looks and yeah, just play it by ear, guys. Yeah, just for yeah. Yeah, I think that looks way better, to be honest. So Jake just added that corner little piece just to kind of connect the line from the headlight to where the grill meets the corner. Yeah, I think that looks way better. I agree. Yeah. It makes the grill look a little bit bigger. Yeah, so it, it, it follows the grill line and it opens it up a little bit. Just a little small detail, but I think it looks better than just having it cut off right, yeah. right straight into the grill if it just right. kind of goes on an angle right there. I agree. Yeah, and I it think it looks that, more like the RS5, right? right? Yeah, the RS, RS, RSQ8. Like, bigger, like blocked area or yeah. whatever. Yeah. So. So we're, we're trying to go with that RSQ8 look. They have the big carbon fiber front grill that kind of connects into the headlights and it looks sweet. So that's what we're kind of trying to replicate here just with adding that little bit of uh, vinyl to the front end. And I think just that corner strip really completes the whole look. So yeah, I think that's the move for sure. Hell yeah. Boys, we just finished the wrap on the front of the grill. It looks amazing right now. The lines flow into the grill. Just adding that little bit of black wrap just, I don't know, makes the grill more aggressive. It pops out um, a lot more. So we're gonna close the hood, see what it looks like, but I'm pretty pumped for what it looks like right now. So wanna do the honors, close the hood, and we'll see what she looks like. Yeah, we'll pop that back in. I think that's how, yeah, there we go. Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. It's, it looks even for sure. Okay, Jake just finished the front end. It looks awesome guys it almost has that rsq8 style where it just flows right in from the headlights to the grill but it completely changed the whole look it looks awesome uh jake did a good job putting it on i mean it just looks beautiful right now i'm super excited for that little addition to the front end right now we're gonna hit up the rear we're gonna do the tail lights as well as a spoiler and then these side markers uh down below we're gonna do that in like a mid i think it was a mid smoke we called it right jake yep so just a uh a mid smoke tint on the rear tails so it's coming together, boys. It's looking pretty sweet so far, so. And girls. And girls, yes, and girls. My 2% viewer watch of girls. Don't forget about you guys.
Ooh, those look really good. So Jake just finished up with the taillights. Those are the medium, what are they, mid, mid smoke? Mid smoke, I don't know, I keep calling them medium, but they're the mid smoke. They look phenomenal right now. I'm gonna hit the uh, turn signal and we'll get to see, I guess, some, some action. They look really, really good right now, the smoke. And then next up we're doing is the um, reflectors in the lower bottom. So it should match it perfectly, but it looks sick right now. So currently we're working on removing the headliner so we can remove the uh, shark fin antenna on top of the car so we can get the wrap uh, underneath that antenna so it'll look, it'll look a lot cleaner. We could wrap around it, but it just wouldn't look as good. So right now we're just working on getting the headliner removed so we can get the roof wrap uh, perfect and seamless on top of the roof. So it's not a bad process. We're just taking apart the handles, uh, the side handles or the oh shit handles as sometimes they're called, um, the rear light frame, and then you kind of can pull back and then we'll have access to the headliner from there. But working on that now, and then we'll get the rest of the rear finished up in the vinyl. And uh, we're almost done, boys. It's looking really good right now, so sweet. I've never seen this before. This is knifeless tape. What Jake is using, it's super cool. There's a, was it a fishing wire yeah. or fishing line? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. It's a fishing wire that's in between there. It's like yeah, in between the tape, and once you peel up that fishing line, it does like a perfect cut, and so you don't have to use knife on your paint. So pretty cool. So the roof has just gotten done being wrapped. It's looking phenomenal right now. The guys did an awesome job on it. The only problem we do have is that the shark fin is white and it is ceramic coated. Uh, as you guys know in the previous videos, we did get the ceramic coat on it. So it might have a problem with it being wrapped. Uh, we're gonna try to get it off right now. Jake's working on it. Hopefully we can wrap it so it doesn't stand out too much, but if it doesn't, then we might have to get it painted or find a different solution. But we're gonna try this route first and see what happens. Definitely putting these guys' skills to the test on wrapping this little piece for sure, but we'll figure it out. You just have to make things difficult. <laughs> A little, a little imperfections out. Mm. Oh, it looks fucking tits. Is it recording? Yeah. Oh, it's recording. You told me. You told me to. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> You're not supposed to be recording. Well, that's good. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I, I do what I'm told like a good woman. Yeah, that's true. Don't put that in the book. No, I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> Boys, you did it. Wrapped the shark fin. Unbelievable. Sweet deal.
I didn't think it was going to work. I think it was going to happen. I believed in Jake. I didn't believe in myself. <laughs> Good for you. It's dumb, boys. We're going to put it on. We'll get the car back together. And, we'll, uh, and girls. And girls. Boys and girls. We're going to get the car back together. We're going to see how it looks. Thank you. Uh, we just hear your laughter. It's all good. <laughs> it adds to it. <laughs> like, man, you're having a really good time wrapping that shark fit over there. You know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Patience, man. The roof took like 10 minutes. The shark, the shark took, like, it took like an hour. That was, the long, an hour. that was the longest piece. No, it, didn't, it didn't take an hour. It took him like 15 minutes, maybe at most. <laughs> the same time it took to do the roof. Yeah, that's true. But it's black now. <laughs> you ever do something where you could just you could just get it there, but that's only like, oh sh. He's not tinting cars. He's doing yoga. His <laughs> hot yoga seminars. Dedication, man. Take five. I could show you some other great yoga. Pictures, you know, <laughs> yeah, I need some yoga. yoga after that one. What's my shoulder? All right. Chris can finally go home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the boys did a knock-up job on the roof. The fin is back in. Probably the most difficult part was putting it back in, but it's back in. Uh, Jake was doing some yoga in the back seat, but we finagled it in there, and it's looking killer right now, guys. The roof is looking so good. It's flowing so well with the rest of the car, going with this panda stormtrooper theme. I think everyone else is convinced. See, Jake's not convinced. Jake, it's Jake panda? Was, I told you, I talked to the car in the back. Okay, so it's panda themed, I guess. So we'll leave a comment below. Like for panda, we'll leave a comment for a stormtrooper. Like the stormtrooper comment. We'll, we'll figure it out, guys, but I think I kind of like panda too. Um, but the roof is done, it's looking awesome. We got one more thing we're doing, and that is the rear spoiler. Uh, Jake's gonna prep the surface now and get that wrapped up. Once we're done, we're gonna pull the car out, do a full 360 review of the car, show what it looks like. But guys, it is looking so good right now. So. Panda, panda, panda. Just finished doing the rear. It is looking awesome. Well, we're gonna back it up. We'll do a quick 360, show you what the whole entire car looks like, but it is looking killer right now. Huge shout out to the guys at Shaded Days. They did an awesome job with our S4 guys. It is looking so sweet. The build is coming along so nicely. If you guys need any of your window tints done, any roof wraps, yeah. uh, any ceramic coating detailing, whatnot, Shaded Days got you guys. Hook them up. I'll leave the link for their shop and their Instagram in the description below. Be sure to check these guys out. They do some killer work. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more content with the S4, and we will see you guys on the next one. Thank you. Where do I begin?